Hello everyone. Yesterday I posted two polls, uh, and here I am going to discuss one of the two polls. The question was a true/false question. The statement was: For ice water equilibrium system, if we increase pressure, melting point of ice decreases. Guys, if I write that ice water equilibrium. i can say the temperature at which this equilibrium is established the temperature is the melting temperature of melting point of ice now we know according to le chatelier principle if we increase pressure equilibrium shifts in a direction where volume is less in this case in water ice equilibrium volume of ice is greater than volume of water if we compare with normal you know uh, liquid solid equilibrium liquid solid equilibrium like if i take sulfur liquid sulfur solid here we can say volume of liquid is greater than volume of solid Now, in the first case, when we increase pressure, the equilibrium will get disturbed. Equilibrium will shift towards water because volume of water is less. Now, to restore equilibrium, to restore equilibrium, we need to decrease temperature. We need to make more ice. We need to decrease temperature. So, at new equilibrium, the temperature will be less, and that will be the melting point of ice. So, what can we say? when pressure is increased the melting point of ice decreases but in the second case sulfur liquid sulfur solid in this case when pressure is increased pressure is increased equilibrium shifts in the direction of solid now to restore equilibrium we need to melt this solid so temperature should be increased so we can say the new equilibrium will be established at greater temperature so melting point here we can say increases melting point in this case decreases on increasing pressure hope this is clear to everyone if you have any doubts you can write in comment box till then bye bye